What's happening? Okay. <gasps> it's Jafar. Is he? Okay. Oh. Aha! It worked. At last, it worked. After uh, an eternity. Huh? Tiffany? Do you hear me? How do you know my name? Well, you may not remember me, but I most assuredly remember you. These crude devices allow me to speak with you, but I'm afraid they are not without their malfunction. At last, our connection seems to be stable. Greetings. I am Jafar, Royal Vizier of Dreamlight Valley. Before the forgetting, I was your closest, most trusted advisor. Uh, I'm listening. What's going on? I reach out to you now with a grave warning. All of time and space is in peril. Uh, um, could you elaborate? Listen closely to my tale, and then I will tell you how to set the world right. During the forgetting, I set out on a journey and discovered a land beyond the waters of Dreamlight Valley. It's pretty. I like it. A land called Eternity Isle. A place filled with ancient relics that yeah. empower their wielder to control time. But then everything went wrong. Eternity Isle became lost in time and I became trapped there. But now, at last, I've found a way to communicate with you. If we have any hope of saving Dreamlight Valley, you must venture to Eternity Isle and free me. How did you discover Eternity Isle? It was fate, or perhaps a fortuitous accident. During the forgetting, I began to assume my most deserved role as Sultan of Dreamlight Valley. All I wanted was to restore order, of course. I somehow doubt that. You sound just like that street rat Aladdin and incompetent genie. They refused to trust me, even though I was clearly the rightful ruler. They cast me out, exiled me. But as luck would have it, I found myself cast away on Eternity Isle, an island full of ancient treasures and powerful relics. These ancient relics that control time? Tell me more. It seems Eternity Isle was once home to an ancient civilization. They studied the secrets of time and space and filled the island with treasures and wonders. You will no doubt find some of them on your journeys across the isle. Being able to control time and space? Sounds like a big responsibility. Yes, only someone possessing infinite wisdom could handle it. Someone like a, a royal vizier, perhaps. I'm ready. How do I get to Eternity Isle? I will send a means of transportation to you. Where will I find? Oh, no, where will I find this means of transportation? There is a port of many way worlds hidden here. Is this supposed to say portal? Anyway, there you will find the ancient vessel. Oh no, a port. A port. Visit the wizard Merlin. He must remember by now. The old fool always was sharper than he seemed. Tank the ancient vessel and travel to Eternity Isle. Once you reach the island, look for another mysterious device just like this one. They will allow us to communicate. Alright. Well then, welcome. Hey everybody. <laughs> We're back in Disney Dreamlight Valley. It was a different type of intro there. Uh, we just got thrown right into it, so I wanted to see that through. But anyway, I'm so happy to be here with you guys because we have our very first ever Disney and Dreamlight Expansion Pass release. And I am so excited. Um, it's called A Rift in Time. And obviously it starts out like this. And we're gonna go, we're just gonna play through it. So this is going to be separate from my Dreamlight Valley Let's Play. If you are new here and you wanna go watch my Dreamlight Valley Let's Play, we're gonna keep continuing that as well. It's where a lot of updates will be and just anything in the, the valley and not on Eternity Isle, essentially. So this game playthrough will be exclusively for a Rift in Time Eternity Isle. And then you, you get it, you get it. So make sure you go check out those videos if you're interested. But anyway, I'm so excited to be starting this Let's Play. Um, we have, Merlin has remembered something about a very special place in Dreamlight Valley. We got to talk to him, so we need to find him. Oh, okay. Uh, hold on. This is part of the update. I gotta. Uh, let's see. Presence of NPCs in different villages. 
So they can come and go between villages. So I'm guessing to Eternity Isle as well, maybe, perhaps? Is that what they mean? Um, we'll see, yeah. So in the map menu, open the characters tab with F to decide which characters can come to the current village. Enable or disable characters. Disable characters will show up if you need them for a special action or quest. All right. So anyway, Merlin, he's down this way. So let's go and see what's what's going down. I'm I'm very intrigued. Hey Merlin. Oh Tiffany, hello. you're right on schedule. I've just remembered something of the utmost importance. There's a hidden place in Dreamlight Valley from which you can travel to the furthest reaches of the world. Uh I'd love to see more of what's out there. Of course you do. Why there's so much to discover, so much to research. Oh. We, what we seek in the dream castle, meet me there. What we seek is in the dream castle. Meet me there whenever you're ready to begin your journey. I'm ready. Let's go. I'm going to remove this so I can get through. I feel like, do I need to empty my inventory? Do I have anything in my inventory? I mean, there's a pretty good chance I'm going to want to... I'm just going to, like, ditch that seed packet and we'll we'll get that later. But we shall see how this goes. This is going to be very interesting. I'm I'm not sure. I was very unsure how this was all going to play out. So we're 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 experiencing this together. Oh. Follow Merlin to the gate in the Dream Castle. Okay, so I guess we'll travel via Dream Castle, which is kind of handy dandy, much like the realms. I would guess. Well, hello. Now then, beyond this gate, you'll discover places that will change everything you know about Dreamlight Valley. Oh, where did I put that key? Hmm. Uh, did you check your pockets? Right, right. Um, <laughs> aha, I've got it. It was sewn into a tiny pocket in my elbow. Well, I hope it's not, I hope it's the right one. <laughs> Me too. Pretty good, eh? <laughs> Eureka, it worked. Well, what are you waiting for? Step through the gate and find out what's on the other side. I wouldn't dare spoil the surprise. Well, All right, well, I guess this is it. So here's a little sign that is, I guess, to Eternity Isle, which is very cool. Um, this is quite interesting. I thought we'd have to go through a door, but I guess we're going through here. So let's go ahead and enter Eternity Isle. Oh, where are we going now? Oh, okay. I've seen this place. This is like from when we were with Fairy Godmother, right? So look at all that potential. That's cool. All right. Well, hello. Welcome to the Stardust Port, Tiffany. From here, you can explore the furthest reaches of the world. There are countless locations around Dreamlight Valley that you've yet to visit. I must say, I'm looking forward to the adventures and discoveries that await out there. Is this safe? Will I always be able to come back here? Of course, Tiffany. In the blink of an eye, and the villagers here will be able to visit you wherever you go. To infinity and beyond. <laughs> Oh, precisely. That's the spirit. Yay. Whatever you wish to venture, whenever you wish to venture somewhere else, simply approach one of the conveyances waiting here for you. I dare say that as you keep discovering more locations beyond Dreamlight Valley, the Stardust Port is sure to fill up with countless ships, flying contraptions, and chariots. The possibilities are endless. Exploration awaits. Yeah, that's what I was just saying. Like, this is crazy. So they're technically, like, if we're thinking in the future, each one of these were an expansion pass. That's six total expansion passes, so five more to go. <laughs> All right, so we got to interact with the Eternally, Etern Eternity Isle. Sorry, interact with the ancient vessel to travel to the Eternity Isle. So this is this is it, guys. This is, this is the moment. Um, this is very interesting because just, like, looking at it, first glance, I thought it was, like, a spaceship or something. <laughs> You know? Oops. Stop it. Stop. <laughs> but doesn't it kind of look like a spaceship? I don't know if that's what it would. I don't. What is it supposed to be? I don't know. Um, anyway, let's go ahead and travel, I guess. And off we go into the expansion pass. A rift in time. This is so cool. Ooh, look at me traveling on the boat down there. That looks so unsafe. There's monkeys. And waterfalls and hey, those look like nasturtiums and that looks like queen anne's lace but i don't know if that's what that is um what else do we have here lots of cool stuff i love the trees there i am walking on into this this mess oh, there he is at last you've arrived welcome tiffany to eternity isle you find yourself at ancient landing don't let the scenery fool you there are countless treasures to be found here but it's fraught with peril 
Uh, it's so amazing. Yes, it is a marvel, isn't it? However, at the moment, that is irrelevant. We have no time to lose. Your first task will be to find the ancient gate that leads deeper into the island. It is up to those nearby... It, it is up those nearby stairs. You have no doubt noticed that way is blocked by these strange formations... Sh formations, excuse me. Jutting out of the ground? Uh, they're beautiful. I have named them Splinters of Fate. They are wounds in the very fabric of time, but they should be no match for your dreamlike magic. Simply focus your attention on them, and they will mend. Just like how I removed night thorns back in Dreamlight Valley. Got it. If you are ever unsure of what to do next, you may contact me at one of these devices. There is another one beside the ancient gate. Clear the way and speak to me there. Okay, so he wants me to go up the stairs, right? Reach the ancient gate that leads deeper into the turning aisle. Clear away the splinters of fate by approaching them and pressing E. Um, are these the splinters of fate that he's talking about? That's cool. So we're gonna get, I'm assuming we're gonna, like there's fishing. Oh my gosh, I wanna do so much stuff because I'm sure there's a bunch of different things. Also, how's this gonna work in this menu? Like, um, collection. Oh, okay. I like this new collections menu. That way, because there's going to be different things here. I don't think I'll be able to... Oh, I can preview the fish. Oh my gosh, the sandworm! I love the sea snail. Sorry. Um. Anyway, so there's like all new everything. It's like a whole set of different things. That's really cool. All right, but we're still getting the same old like coal and things. And I guess there's new Dreamlight Valley or sorry, Dreamlight tasks as well, which is we get these things instead of Dreamlight. I don't... I don't know. And then we have our whole new Eternity Isle, like, specific things. Um, oh gosh, I think... Oh man, of course this happened. I think I kind of want to explore instead of play. Is that is that bad? Or are you guys not going to want to watch that? I don't know. I, I, I really kind of just want to wander around at this point. There's just so much cool stuff. Alright, well, hello. We have a strawberry bush. We got strawberry? Like, also, we'll... How do our inventories work? Oh, we got new seeds. Okay, so our inventories are all the same, which is good. You know, I'll take this stuff back home. Actually, that's probably bad because I just got done working on a, I'm not even done yet. I started working on like a flower room and a fish room, but if there's gonna be all new stuff, I'm gonna have to do like separate floors in the house. Like they'll have to be a dream light flower room and then it turned in the aisle flower room. Anyway, this is our first seed. We got a yam seed. And then, of course, this is new, too. I kind of want to... I don't know. I'm going to put all of those up there. And we want to focus on some of the new stuff here. Um, we're going to, hopefully by the end of the episode, make our way to the gate. But I want to look at so much of this stuff. This looks like Queen Anne's Lace, but I don't know what it is. Oh, it's cumin. Okay. An earthy spice. I know that one all too well. What is this? This is just a decoration. And then we have a, a thing. Also, what about energy here i mean these are seats obviously we can get our energy up with seats and stuff i just don't know if we'll be able to place a house or what's gonna happen oh, surely we could place some kind of house so we can get our energy back up anyway um we've got flowers here i'm gonna collect a few things and we will kind of come back to the inventory and look at them and see what we're working with we've got our first memory for this place Let's see what it is. Or is it this? It's a Dreamlight Valley memory that we got? Okay. I don't know what's up with that. Alright, well, I'm just gonna keep clearing some of these. What are they called again? Splinters of Fate. Gosh, remembering all this is gonna be a little bit. Um, these look cool. I don't know if I'm gonna get... I'll probably get those with my pickaxe, maybe? Um, should I... I wanna go fishing! There's so much stuff I wanna do. Okay. But for real... Where's the gate? <laughs> also, do we have a map? Oh, the map. Oh, whoa. Jeez, what the? Okay. So, it's interesting how each one of these has a different name. Because, you know, well, it's like back home. We're going to say back home for Dreamlight Valley. You know, this would be like the Glittering Dunes, right? But inside the Glittering Dunes, we have names now. The Oasis, the Plains, the Borderlands, the Wastes. That's really cool. So there's one, two, three biomes, I'm gonna say. Three, right? What's this? This is my house? 
Oh, is that where I'm going? Is that the bridge that I'm supposed to be clearing? Because Wait, where is that? Uh, okay, this is the bridge over here. We'll come back, I promise. I just, I'm distracted. Okay, I need to focus. Let's clear the bridge and see what we get um, moving forward. This will be access to my home, I guess. So, uh, pickaxe. Do I remember? No, here we go. Oh, I can't get through here? Reach the ancient gate. That's not the ancient gate. What am I doing? That, this is like to my house? Like, actually, that's Eve's house. Why was I thinking that was my house? I guess I just saw the house icon. All right, there's a chest. Is this my like little inventory chest? That'd be nice. Ooh, there's stuff in here too. I'm gonna put my strawberries in here and call it a day. But let's, oh, there's even a Scrooge McDuck shop here. Okay, so there's Majest, Majesty, Majesty? Arom aromatic blue and silver leaves can be used for many things like brewing a tea and dyes. And strawberries, plastic scrap, it looks like garbage are used to make something more. And shiny jade, a shiny jade. There's nothing more to say about that. So we have this this shop, like what? Um, there's something there that I gotta dig up. I don't know if my tools work here, because I couldn't, I couldn't get those rocks with my pickaxe, but that might just be because it's locked or something. Alright, so I need to find the real, the ancient gate. I was thinking ancient bridge, don't ask me why, but, um, here's something. I need to get my pickaxe working here. It does not work here. Let's look at the map. Alright, there's gonna be a gate, gate, gate. Oh, that's my house. There's a wishing well. Oh, I could travel to the wishing well. I didn't want to do that. I kind of wanted to walk there so I could find my way around. But I came up here, up these stairs, and I have a house here. Okay, that's great news. Um, gate. This seems like a gate. Okay, that's something I need to unlock. Okay, so we're in the same... This would be a different biome? Okay. Yeah, it'd be the Ancients Landing biome, and then we have the Wild Tangle and the Glittering Dunes, and then whatever the heck that is. That's like the Jafar's castle, it looks like. So, we have mail. I'll deal with that later. Okay, this has to be the gate. How many minutes did it take me to find the gate? Talk to Jafar using the hologram station. Is this it? Is this not it? Uh, Is this not the... Do I need to get rid of my... Hold on. Where's the hologram station? I thought it was those little things right here. Am I imagining things? How do I... Oh, this is it. Oh my gosh. It's only me. I was thinking it was that thing. Hello, Jafar. Ah, Tiffany, there you are. Good. As you can see, the ancient gate is closed. There used to be a sphere here that powered the gate, allowing it to open. It looked just like the other blue spheres around the gate. But alas, it has been broken and the pieces scattered into the wind. All thanks to that flying, chirping metal nuisance. Metal nuisance? That is a story for another time. The pieces of the ancient sphere must be in the vicinity. Search ancient landings for the pieces. You will find a crafting station here where you can repair it. Then place the ancient sphere in the gate to open it. I guess while I'm looking for those, I should explore around here and start making it a home. Okay, now I can explore. Now I have permission to explore. <laughs> it looks like Mr. McDuck once tried to set up a store here. And is that one of Goofy's stalls? I'll have to check everything out. Looks like other villagers are already starting to come visit. Well, I'm not ready, guys. Stay stay home till I'm ready here. All right, we got some new quests. So I did end up finding a piece of sphere down at the bottom. Even I discovered this weird hourglass. The sand inside is shimmering. Woo! But, um, what was I saying? <laughs> oh yeah, wait, no. I was gonna say people are already here and I'm not quite ready. Like, I feel like I definitely wanna, you know, straighten the place up a little bit. Um, we'll definitely wanna explore. So we kind of already found some cool things. I wanna like, Use the pickaxe and stuff. I really could, yeah, like there's the other half of the sphere. This is this a birds of paradise? Oh, they're birds of paradise flowers. That's so nice. Oh, these are so cool. So, so far, this is all the stuff we got. Different colors of birds of paradise. Vanillope's here, randomly. And so is Mickey. I'm wondering, I don't know if I'd be able to access their quest, like back home. Like, I'm not sure how that would work. 
All right, um, trying to get a shovel here. I'm just gonna grab this uh, here, this other sphere piece, and we're still gonna continue to explore before I repair this ancient piece. Where should I repair the ancient piece? I'm just gonna, I gotta clear this space up. I love those little fences here, these like, well, I guess they're pipes. I thought they were a lot like pieces of wood or bamboo at first, but I think they're just old pipes. Um, anyway, gotta collect up all of this stuff and I'm gonna just continue to explore, I think for a little bit longer. Um, and we're not gonna accept any quests from anybody just yet. So picking up some sticks and stuff, we're a little frozen at the moment. This is so much fun though. I'm so excited for this. So I definitely need to figure out where I want to place all the strawberry bushes and stuff. I also want to get this, uh, see what kind of gems we can get. I'm sure it's going to be, oh, no, we got new material. It looks like iron maybe? Where is it? Oh, copper, copper and quartz. Cool, oh my gosh, is this? Okay, uh, there's our wishing well, which I love this wishing well spot this is so pretty and um, these both of these stairs lead down to where we were before i'm not sure that this i'm not sure that we can remove these it's not really giving me any options so i'm gonna say no this is the nasturtium it looks like that's really cute um but we're gonna just keep going this i think is goofy's stall should i go ahead and and pick up that sign let me open up this chest here all right, let me see, pick it up. All right, so I got quest started for that. And I'm guessing that's for Goofy's stall there, which we're gonna have to organize everything and, oh, Goofy's here now. They just appear like that. All right, I'm gonna pick that up, the little memory thing. Yeah, so I can't quite get those sandy dune sand swirls picked up or anything yet. I'm thinking those are going to be later um, same with this pickaxe. I think I'm gonna need to like upgrade my pickaxe or something. That would be the what unless it's like the sand of time hourglass thingy that they were talking about that would undo it. But so far, I want to put this strawberry bush. Can I move things right now? I take this strawberry bush up to the house. Where am I at? Ooh, okay. I don't want to cheat. I don't want to look. Um, we're gonna just put our strawberry bushes down here. I want to check and see if there's more. I think those are the only strawberry bushes. I can move my uh, little inventory chest for now. It's literally just a regular chest. Is that facing the right way? I don't know. Um, so I don't, it's a tree that I could, oh, it's a tree. Obviously it's a tree, but I thought it was a tree that grew something for a second, but I don't think so. I'll definitely have to move a lot of this stuff around um, at some point, but not right now. I'm just kind of getting the strawberries and the other basics right now while I'm wandering around. So let's see, I can't get the rocks. There's a cooking station. We got more flowers here or spice. I guess it's more like the basil, right? That's in the valley. This is also really cute seating right here. I like the layout of the place overall. I'm just gonna collect all of these up. And then let's see, can't get that. I can get collect all of these up though. I'm excited to see like what collectibles there are. That's probably my favorite part. <laughs> and like forageables. So there's this, I could pick that up. Okay, and Mr. McDuck's here now. And then I pick this up. I think the next episode is gonna be a little chaotic just because there's so many people here that, that have something to say and want me to start quests. Oh, but I'm so excited. All right. Oh, I think we got an attorney aisle one. The hourglass seems to do funny things with time. I saw something strange when I used it. So we got two eternity aisle thingy majigs. All right. I think I cleared most of that up. And then there's a few things over here. I think this is the only rock spot over here. Got to familiarize myself with the new place. It's so nice. I like the vibes here. It's very nice. Cool. All right. I think I, I think I covered everything and I got all of the things that I needed to get. Um, hey, over here. 
I know, Mickey, I'll get to you. But I think that's everything that I can collect up for right now. But I'm so excited to get started here. I wonder if I could change the skin of my house and stuff. That's something we'll have to explore later, too. But this is insane. This is crazy. I can't believe we're here with this, this, this new world or village, whatever. But you guys will have to let me know what you think of this first little look of it. This part one of this... Shh, Vanillope, I'm talking. Um, of this first part here. I, like I said, I'm so excited. This is going to be a really, really fun playthrough. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe and I will see you next time.